The Saints now have some work to do to fill out their secondary after informing Marcus May that he will be released at the start of the new league year. I'm Nick Underhill, and you're watching a dot presented by Matt Bowers Auto Group. The one thing the Saints have done well over the years is find help at safety, and a lot of times they've done that through the draft. Von Bell, Jordan Howden, Marcus Williams, they found these guys all outside of the first round, and it looks like that's what they're going to have to do again to fill out their safety depth chart. Now, they're set up well for the immediate future. Tyron Matthew and Jordan Howden will probably be the starters next season at those spots, but they still need a third guy to help fill out because they use three safety sets so often. So bringing back Lonnie Johnson Jr. is obviously an option and something that they'll probably look to do. And they also have Jonathan Abram, who's a free agent, who might find his way back next season as well. But the team needs to get another guy into the pipeline to develop to play alongside Howden a few years down the road. Now that could be something they look to do in this draft with one of those fifth round picks that they have. Or that could be something that happens in the future, but it needs to be on their card as something that they need to figure out how to get done. This move will save the Saints about $2 million against the cap. And it is interesting because safety is one of the positions in the NFL that has become undervalued a little bit. And you can get a lot of bang for your buck in those mid rounds or with your dollars. But if you're paying $7 million a year for a player and you don't feel like you're getting top 10 production, spending that money doesn't make a lot of sense. And that seems to be where the Saints ended up with May after he missed a ton of games over the last two seasons. And at times the play was leaving a little bit something to be desired. So they're going to move to their younger players. But in the future, they need to find a way to keep that pipeline strong and make sure that there is young talent coming up behind Howden for the future.